Ron Peter Vlier is a Dutch footballer who plays as a centre-back for Premier League club Aston Villa FC, who he captains. Vlier is also a regular at centre-back for the Netherlands national team. Vlier has regularly been acknowledged as one of the best defenders at the 2014 FIFA World Cup. Early life, Vlier was born in Hensbroek, North Holland. His mother, Margaret, was a handball player, while his father was an amateur football player. Vlier has two younger sisters, Ellen and Lizen, who are both active in sports as well. Ellen is a gymnast and Lizen plays volleyball. Club career, youth, in Hensbrook, Vlier joined local club Apollo 68 at the age of six. Apollo 68 youth coach Keyes Wheat was quickly convinced, but when he was five, he was already allowed to train with us. You could already see how good he was. He had a powerful kick with both his left and right leg, and a very good one as well. Besides, he had a fantastic mentality. Ron always wanted to win and become better. When he went to his final year in elementary school, Blair left Apollo 68. The youngster wanted to play on a higher level and joined SVW 27 from here gold. At his new club, Blair's development went well above expectation. After playing for SVW 27 for one season, Blair got invited to join the AZ Youth Academy, a professional side playing in the East Divisi. In 2002, Blair signed his first youth contract. The contract would keep him in Eichmara until summer 2007. AZ, in the 2004 Euro 05 season, Blair made his unexpected Odivisi debut at the age of 20. Due to injuries and suspensions within the first team squad at the end of the season, Blair was paired up with the experienced centre Black Barry Optim on April 23, 2005 in the away match against RKC Woolwich. Five days later, on April 28, 2005, Blower made his European debut. The youngster was part of the starting lineup in the UEFA Cup semi final away match against Sporting Clube de Portugal. Blair played three Odivisi matches and two UEFA Cup matches in his debut season. While Blair thought the season 2005 a Euro 06 would be his breakthrough year, AZ coach Louis van Gaal kept choosing for more experienced players. Blair was part of the starting lineup thrice while he came in as a substitute in four matches, having a total of seven Eldivisi appearances in his first half year. Despite Blair's substitute status at AZ, the youngster impressed the Netherlands coach Marco van Basen enough to invite him for his first international matches. As Blair was only playing at AZ for a youth contract, various sides were interested to offer Blair more playing time. AZ were keen to offer Blair a new and improved contract, However Blair had no interest in staying at AZ as he felt blackmailed by AZ coach Louis van Gaal, he told me I would only play at emergencies if I wouldn't sign the new contract. The young centre-back was close to a deal with Ajax and was spotted in London, as he was visiting Martin Joel's Tottenham Hotspur with his father and agent. However, on December 28, 2005, Blair signed a three-and-a-half-year deal with Feyenoord. Feyenoord. At Feyenoord. Blair quickly became a first-team starter. Blair made his official Feyenoord debut on January 15, 2006, in the away match against Vitus. Blair played 16 Eldivisi matches after his winter break transfer, without scoring any goals. Blair had a bad start of the season 2006 a Euro 07, as he got foot injury in the pre-season match against Reading in August. At first it seemed to be a minor injury but Blair had to drop out in the 33rd minute of the season opening away match against FC Groningen. The doctors found a crack in a bone in his foot, causing Blair to be out for almost the entire first half of the league. After his recovery, Blair regained his place in the first team and played 20 Eredivisie matches in the remaining season. On December 16, 2006, Blair scored his first Feyenoord goal in the away match against FC Utrecht. With the arrival of the new Feyenoord coach Bert van Mulwich and new centre-back partner Kevin Hofland in the season 2007 a Euro 08, Blair was ready to make the next step in his development. However, on September 16, 2007, Blair got injured in the Eredivisie away match against Roda JC. Blair needed a surgery on the cruciate ligament and was out for the rest of the season. After the surgery, 
Hitler was confronted with an additional setback, as he had a bacterial infection. Blair recovered from his injury at the beginning of the 2008-09 season. However, during pre-season, Blair got another injury at a medial collateral ligament of his knee. After being sidelined for over a year, Blair returned to the training field. After an innocent coming together with Kevin Hoefland, Blair damaged his cruciate ligament again. It was the same injury he had in the previous season, causing him to miss a complete season again. After being sidelined for two seasons, Blair made a strong comeback in the 2009-10 season. One highlight was a 60-meter distance goal in the KNVB Cup away match against Hark Mace Boys on September 24, 2009. Once he returned, he formed a strong partnership with Brazilian centre-back Andra Copyright Band, earning praise with his imposing body and impressive displays. In the 2011 Euro 12 season, he played a key role in reaching second place in the Eredivisie with Feyenoord, securing a spot in the third qualifying round of the 2012 Euro 13 UEFA Champions League. Aston Villa, on July 15, 2012 Feyenoord confirmed that Vla had travelled to Birmingham to hold talks with Aston Villa manager Paul Lambert with a view to a possible transfer. During Villa's pre-season tour of the United States, however, Vla admitted that the deal was off and he would remain with Feyenoord. In another turn of events, it was then announced on July 27 that he would eventually be joining the Premier League side, as he had agreed personal terms and would sign for Villa subject to him passing a medical. On August 1, Blair officially joined Aston Villa, signing a three-year contract. On September 15, Blair was named captain for the 2012 Euro 13 season in the continued absence of club captain Stelayan Petrov, as the Bulgarian battled cancer. His first game as captain resulted in Aston Villa's first win of the season, a 2 Euro 0 win over Swansea City. On April 29, 2013, Blair scored his first goal for the club with a 30-yard strike in a 6-Euro-1 victory over Sunderland. His second goal for Villa, in the last game of the season, a 2-Euro-2 2 draw away at Wigan Athletic, came from a spectacular half-volley from just inside the penalty area. Following the club's finish just above the relegation zone, in 15th, Blair told the club's youngsters that they must learn from their mistakes. International Career Youth Blair represented the Netherlands at various youth levels. However, he had most success with the Netherlands U20 on the 2005 FIFA World Youth Championship and with Netherlands U21 on the UEFA European Under-21 Football Championship in 2006 and 2007. The 2005 FIFA World Youth Championship took place in the Netherlands between June 10 and July 2, 2005. Blair, reserve captain behind Hedwiges Maduro, was an important player in the Dutch team and was active in every match the team played on the tournament. Netherlands U20 had a smooth run through the group stage, winning their three matches respectively easy against Japan U20, Australia U20 and Benin U20. After beating Chile U20 in the next round, the Netherlands U20 reached the quarter-finals against later finalist Nigeria U20. Despite Blair's equalizing goal and successful penalty kick, the Netherlands U20 didn't advance to the next stage. Netherlands U21 Blair was part of the Netherlands U21 on the 2006 UEFA European Under-21 Football Championship, where the Dutch side claimed the trophy for the first time in history. Besides the group match against Denmark U21, Blair played in every match on the tournament. Jong Aranji started and finished their campaign against Ukraine U21 going out on a high with a 3 Euro 0 win in the final, after surprisingly losing their opening game to the Ukrainian team. Twelve months after winning the UEFA European Under-21 Football Championship for the first time, Blair was the captain of the team that retained the trophy in style with a 4 Euro 1 win against Serbia U21 in the final. Blair played in every match in the group stage, but had to leave the pitch injured in the semi-final match against England U21. Blair had to watch the final from the sideline, but was able to lift the trophy together with reserve captain Hedwiges Maduro. Netherlands, in the few matches the promising defender played, he made enough of an impression to be noticed by Marco van Basen, the coach of the Netherlands national team. 
he was selected for the qualifier against Romania in June 2005, but did not play. The first international match in which he played was a match against the Czech Republic on October 8, 2005. Since his comeback for Feyenoord, he became a first-choice regular in the Feyenoord team. His appearances for Feyenoord were noticed by the national team coach Bert van Marwij, who officially stated to be following him in the run-up to the 2010 World Cup. However, not yet calling Vloa to the national team, due to the severity of his previous injuries, allowing him to gradually come to full fitness and preventing overuse of muscles since Vloa only came back to first-team football in the summer of 2009. However, Van Marwich stated he would seriously consider calling Vloa up in the second half of the season. Vloa was included in the preliminary squad for the 2010 FIFA World Cup in South Africa. However, on May 27, 2010, Netherlands manager Bert van Marwijk announced that the player would not be part of the final squad of 23 participating in the competition. On May 7, 2012, he was named in the provisional list of 36 players for the UEFA Euro 2012 tournament by van Marwijk. On June 2, 2012 he scored his first international goal with a header from a corner kick by Ibrahim Afile, the last goal in a 6 Euro 0 friendly win over Northern Ireland. In the World Cup 2014 Blair played all seven matches, in which he received much credit for leading the defence. The Netherlands did not lose any matches in the normal time, with a Blair headed defence conceding four goals. In the semi-final against Argentina, Blair took the first penalty kick, after being one of the best players on the field throughout the official playing time. He however missed, just like Dutch midfielder Wesley Snyder which caused the Dutch to lose and face Brazil in the third-place playoff. After a 3-0 win over the Netherlands won the bronze medal. Blair's biggest achievement as a player for his national team. Career statistics, club, as of June 5, 2014, international, statistics accurate as of matches played on July 14, 2014. Honours, club, Feyenoord, KNVB Cup, 2007 Euro 08, International, Netherlands, UEFA U21 Championship, 2006, 2007, FIFA World Cup third place, 2014, references. External links, stats at Votable International, Ron Vleur profile and stats at Werold Van Orangi, Ron Vleur at national-football-teams.com, Ron Vleur a Euro FIFA competition record.